Pakistan grappling with a severe financial crunch is facing a challenging time. The country's economy is under stress with mounting debts. The International Monetary Fund and World Bank suggested the need for urgent structural reforms. In a recent turn of events, Pakistan has reached out to China for financial aid. The caretaker prime minister requested a 2 billion dollar loan rollover from Chinese premier Li Kang. The prime minister highlighted that Pakistan has secured 4 billion dollars in loans from China. Earlier this month, the UAE rolled over Pakistan's maturing loan of 2 billion dollars. Saudi Arabia has deposited 5 billion dollars with the State Bank of Pakistan. The International Monetary Fund plays a key role in Pakistan's financial recovery. The IMF's upcoming mission is critical for securing the last loan tranche of 1.2 billion dollars. Tranches are segments created from a pool of securities, usually debt instruments such as bonds or mortgages. The IMF will begin negotiations for a new long-term program. The IMF has made new adjustments in its fresh staff level report about the available financing to Pakistan. The Washington-based lender has increased the projection of budget support loans to 3 billion dollars. Budget support is a way of giving international development aid. With budget support, money is given directly to a recipient government country, usually from a donor government. The IMF has cut the project financing to 3.7 billion dollars for this fiscal year. The IMF has now projected the deficit at 5.7 billion dollars or 1.6% of the GDP. As of 2023, Pakistan's debt amounts to nearly 125 billion dollars owed to external creditors with one third to China. Pakistan's economic future hinges on effective management of external debts. The nation is at crossroads with its economic stability and growth at stake. For more informative videos like this, keep watching India Today News Mo.